Hey, Ted. Yeah, Peter. Discord user Plague Spider One says you guys should totally go to the Rito Village and see what's going on with their massive blizzard. Well, I'm pretty much already here. Let's go check it out. Okay. Um, yeah, this will be the regional phenomena. We're gonna get started on this. If I'm fast enough, <coughs> maybe we'll even finish it in one episode. That would be amazing. I, I don't know if I'm do. that fast, but. I have done this several times now. <laughs> and we have a little bit of a trick to short circuit some of the nonsense. It's true. I'm excited about that as well. Oh, this cold and snow is definitely making me think of a Minnesota winter. Did yeah. you know the basement's located in Minnesota? Minnesota is a state in the United States of America. It's at on the, the top, top center of the big, ugly chunk of the country that isn't Alaska or Hawaii. Or right, the uh, lesser-known territories, like Cuba and Puerto Rico. I think we just added territories because 50 is such a nice round number. And everyone likes the configuration of the stars on the flag. It's like, we're not going to go to 51. No. What do you do? Three rows of 17? <laughs> Those are the only things that divide into 51, other than 1 and 51. Might as well get the Korok here. Have we even turned in any Koroks yet? Tweehee. Um, yeah, no, we have a couple extra slots. Like weapon slots. Okay. <coughs> but yeah, I'm excited to to get some more progress on the kind of the main big storyline in this playthrough. Yeah, no, we need... We need, you know, people have great ideas on stuff to do and try, but we need hearts and stamina and, and story, you know? We need, um, champion abilities... And, uh, wow. We can combine that with our current pants and give ourselves probably enough cold resistance to handle. That's pretty smart. Everything. Oh, yeah, you don't get cold until you get into the very bottom temperature in Hyrule. Are you going to cook some stuff? Mm-hmm. Going to cook some tomatoes? Two tomatoes. Two tomatoes. In previous episodes of this series, we would not be allowed to take these meals away with us. But we did that long enough. We accidentally broke that rule a handful of times, and uh, nobody called us on it. So we're like, eh. I think we're not going to hold ourselves to I it. I think we've been given an amnesty. Yep. So we're going to go back to doing things the way that they were in intended. Oh, there goes Rabbity. Oh, he gave us amnesty. <laughs> Is Eminem current enough for you there, Ted? Uh, no. Dang it. You know who's a good new band on the scene? Nirvana. <laughs> the Beatles. <laughs> the Be <laughs> well, the Beatles are mostly still alive. No, they're not. Wait. Paul McCartney died recently. What? Yes. No. They're half alive now. Oh, man. I'm kidding. Paul McCartney's alive. Oh, okay. He's getting old, though. I guess Nirvana's only half alive, because only two of them count. The dead one and the Foo Fighters guy. No one cares about the bass player. Was Nirvana only three people? Yeah, dude. Wow, that's what made it sound so bad. Um, <coughs> I killed Peter with my funny. Matt and Kurt Cobain wasn't very good at guitar, plus he was left-handed, playing right-handed guitars. Good song Where writer, do though. we go here? Uh, maybe the huge glowing obvious glow? No, we did that. Oh. We don't need to go here. Wait, we did that? Why would it still be glowing? I just, I activated it. So oh. We're going to practice. You got to talk to... He's not here. Did he die? Did he go the way of Paul McCartney? <laughs> yes. Did you know that Paul McCartney, he did have a heart attack. Blackbird singing in the dead of night. And he went what, to what? the hospital. Oh, no. And sometimes what happens when you have heart attacks is you'll also have gas. It's like <gasps> this whole, like, indigestion thing. Yeah, sure. And, you know, it's it's a little embarrassing, but, like, he can't help it. Nobody made a big deal out of it or whatever. It's a little smelly, but, you know, hospitals, they don't always smell the best anyway. But uh, uh, the uh, news tabloids uh, headlines were oh, no. Paul McCartney has fart attack. 
I'm shaking my head. <laughs> He's shaking his head with silent laughter. No, the other thing. Disdain. <laughs> Loud frowns. Did we, <laughs> like, maybe already start this and not go? I don't there? know. There's nobody here to talk to. Check oh, your, oh, oh, here they are. Check your quest. I found them. Oh, okay. That's not fair at all. That's not fair at all. I want to go down to the Tasha station to pick up some power converters. <laughs> you play with your friends later, Luke. Oh, I cannot believe I had kids. <laughs> Should have got that vasectomy. <laughs> you hear that sound? That's the sound of not getting fixed. Spade or neutered? Spade or neuter your birds, kids. <laughs> Just kidding. It is you! If we would have been neutered, then we wouldn't have had Tulin. Oh. You know, if you rearrange the words, the letters in Tulin, it spells noodle. N noodle? <laughs> like neutered. <laughs> Nutil. <laughs> Nutil. <laughs> um, or, um, Liant. <laughs> Or nil to <laughs> nil to. <coughs> That's Nilut. definitely the preferred rearrangement. Nutley. <laughs> <laughs> wow, there's just so many possibilities. They should have named them literally anything else with those five letters. So there's a song that we have to go and learn about. Tluny. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, my kid's kind of an idiot. <laughs> Would you go keep an eye on him? I'll, uh... You can have whatever you want out of the fridge. We'll be back at 1030. Lint! Ew. Ew. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's two fires over there. Yep. It's by the fires. Got it's, it. It's crazy how much they, they talk, but, like, you don't remember how long it is. Because you're actually reading it the first time you do right. it. Right. And then when you're, like, zooming through it, you're like, oh, my gosh, they said, like, a whole book. Yeah, well, they only say, like, one or two sentences at a time. So, so every button press is really not that much. It's, like, three button presses per paragraph, and it might be a two or three paragraph thing. I did like coming over here. Was it over here? There's a spot over here where there's a bunch of, like, the future guys and then a bunch of Bokoblins. And they're all, like, decently high level. And, uh... They're not too far apart from each other, so if you just run between them, they notice each other and fight each other. It's pretty slick. Huh. And then you can get a bunch of, like, really good, like, construct horns, you know, to put on your weapons, but also, like, silver bokoblin horns to fuse to your stuff. Oh, it's tempting. <laughs> we'll harass him later. <laughs> will launch his sign into the stratosphere. Oh. 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 I got a really crummy spirit with a really crummy bull goblin horn. Oh. You know, if that tower were uh, activated, then you could see the map. That would help Peter because he hasn't memorized the game yet. It's the same game map as Breath of the Wild. We've been Kinda. playing this for a decade. <clears throat> a decade? That's an exaggeration. It's only Almost been like eight and a half years. <laughs> eh, seven. Be seven years in March. Seven. That's how long uh, Jacob had to work for Leah, the ugly sister. <laughs> He also had to work seven years for Rachel. But that was after the first seven years. I know. I thought, okay, this is a Bible story. Jacob, Leah, and Rachel. You can look it up. It's pretty interesting. But I thought he worked for seven years. And then, like, he's like, no, 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 I want Rachel. And they're like, okay, you can marry Rachel right now. Like, the next day or a week later or whatever. But you still got to work seven years. He's like, okay. So he didn't have to wait 14. He just had to wait seven years, plus... He had to work seven more. Right. Once once the deed was done. Yeah, I would have been really upset. <coughs> I'm like, yeah, that me is too. not the deal. <laughs> we made a deal, and you're going to not follow through on it? Yeah, I'll work I'll work real hard. I'll work real hard at putting poison in your drink. Yeah, real. Four. 
for real. But it's the Bible, and he was trying to, you know, do right by the Lord. (laughs) Yeah, you're supposed to work as though you're working for the Lord and not your employer. But what if your employer makes a very unlordly decision? I think you're still supposed to, unless he's like outright telling you to... (sighs) To disobey God. <coughs> wow, right. Peter. Gosh. I know. We gotta get you some tea. Yeah. Or coffee. Oh, I already drank mine. It wasn't hot. That was the problem. Yeah, you need something warm to loosen the mucus. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> oh, now there's blood in my mucus. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh, use your glide suit. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, as soon as he said, ooh, I knew you had a good idea. Or at least that you thought you had a good idea. See how much better it is? A little. That's that's substantial. Yeah, it is substantial. I'm moving pretty quick. Hey, there's those fires are down there. Ted. Oh, but this will unlock a fast travel location. Yeah. And when we do a shrine episode, we can just bash them out. Oh, it's going to be so much fun. This back on so we don't die. Okay. You know. And then, so we don't die. That's where we want to go. Right here. Ooh. Dude, that looks warm. Relatively. But you can cheat this. You don't have to go in there. You can just go up to where Tulin is. Oh. Well, we might as well. Anyone who wants to see how that works the standard way can pick a any one of a hundred different videos on the internet that shows it. Yeah, and some of those are mine. <laughs> some of those are <laughs> our videos. Yeah, that's true. Some streams. All right, I'll just climb up to the top here. You know, they say that when you uh, go live on YouTube and you really have a very quality show, uh, you can win the Golden Stream Award. Not to be confused with the other Golden Stream Award, which is for writing your name in the snow. With your urine. (laughs) Gross! You know what the hardest part about writing your name in the snow is? Dotting the I. (laughs) That showed me a pee joke video earlier and now I've got <laughs> writing your name in the snow on my mind. Maybe you can't do what I thought you could do. Just go up. Hmm. Or it might be further this way. All I know is it's outside when you meet Tulin. And he's like, yo, that Aracuda stole my bow. Oh, he's on a platform. Yeah, and then he shoots. He wants to shoot at him with his feet. Because bird's wings here. don't have opposable digits. But their feet do. I wonder if you could really train a bird to shoot an arrow. Someone should do that and make a YouTube video out of it. I Cat actually trained baby. a Rito. Cat butt baby. <laughs> it's not going to work. Oh no, now we're trapped. Trapped like rats. Well, we're not though, that's good. I'm real excited to see if this is gonna work. Whoop! Oh. What? Whoop! Oh. Gotta make it eventually anyway. Now don't make like the hot chocolate box. Hi, cat. My deaf cat holiday just opened the door to yawn at me. She's not gonna come in though. She's allergic to Ted. Whoop! You gotta put that on some uh, level ground there. <gasps> Is five the limit of springs? Like, does it not get any springier after five? I don't know. Hmm. I read that somewhere. In a comment, I think, perhaps. Maybe even been a comment reply. Someone's like, use ten springs! And someone else is like, don't do that, it's a waste. The limit is five. I was like, wow, a commenter after my own heart. 
Holy smokerinos. That was a big lift. Might actually be faster to go through the mountain. Ah, the intended way. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure it takes you over. Tunnels you through. Hmm. Or we went too far. Guess we'll find out. We've gone too far. Too far for now, anyways. Too far, far like a too fox. late for now. <coughs> hey, Ted. Yeah. What did you have for dinner today? I had, ooh, what did I have? Pizza. We <gasps> made some Aldi's brand pizza, not sponsored, but Aldi. Oh, but we'd like to be sponsored by Aldi. Yeah, Ted lives would. next to an Aldi, and, and I live next, next to, to a Aldi. different Aldi. And, uh, man, I could just wander through the aisles of that store, Aldi, looking at the deals. Yeah, I like to go there Aldi time. Yeah. Oh, I like to eat food from there Aldi time. Meals of my life. All the meals of my life. It wasn't mac and cheese pizza, was it? You know what they... Because you like that at Pizza Ranch. You know what they never have at Aldi is a sausage pizza. It's true. But we get the we get the Supreme. We get the one with everything on it. Mm. You must not have someone in your family who can't tolerate onions. Do you onions. really have to, like, go through the mountain in order to see Tulin? I went through the mountain in order to see Tulin. Maybe. Yes, sir. Well, I had brown rice, broccoli, and beef. And it was all mm. sauced up somehow. I don't know how. Mm. My wife is, like, magical. Okay, we're going to go back over here. We're going to go through the cave because they're going to make us do it. I thought I was going to be all cool and go like, you know, a back way. I would have thought that would work. Maybe you just don't. You know, Or maybe we did it wrong. Or maybe I went to the wrong place. It's possible. Yeah. It's hard to well, say. We're going to find out. We're going to go over here to the fire pit now. Wait, don't you want to turn left and then go in the cave? This is the cave. It's not the... Oh. Yes, it is 10. <coughs> Ooh, you're not even taking the fire from the fire. Just bringing your own fire. I said fire What's a lot. What's this deal, though? Tulin of Rito Village? Do we have to do this first? I don't know. Maybe if you would have done that, then going up to the top of the mountain would have ah, worked. Ah, I should have set the travel medallion. Did you know that if you beat a Colosseum and then you set a travel medallion inside of one of the, like, cages that doesn't open until you start the Colosseum, mm -hmm. and then a blood moon happens, so the enemies respawn, and then you use the travel medallion, that they won't see you or interact with you? You can't hit them with melee weapons, but you can Whoa. hit them with, like, like, throwing fire fruit at them. They'll burn. So that could Weird. be a pretty good way to uh, make it a little easier on yourself the second time you do a Coliseum. Huh. I think it'd be fun to, like, kill a Lionel that won't interact with you in the Lionel I thought I talked Coliseum. to the right guy, but I forgot. You gotta go in here and talk to this guy. <laughs> Don't get stuck in the sign there. Hey, isn't this a snowboarding <laughs> girl's cabin? Um, in Breath of the Wild? I don't think so. I don't remember. <laughs> Blah, 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 he's in the place. Somebody let us know, yay or nay. Snowboarding girl's cabin in Breath of the Wild. I don't like it when games do this. You shouldn't have had to, like, if Tulin was there already, right. he should be there whether I talked to that guy Tulin's or not. Tulin's up there. For uh, real. Well, he wouldn't have been unless I said that, though. <laughs> should I try to go the fast way again? No. I think I should. There's no other people I gotta talk to. Like, you, now it's just saying go to the place. But the normal way is fun. It's not, though. But you have to listen to me because I'm using extra syllables. Uh, no, I definitely don't. When you use a whiny voice, Peter, we have a rule in our house. 
Yeah. If you whine about something, you don't get it. Even if it's a thing I normally would have given you, like a glass of water. We're not in your house uh, right now. Uh. It's, that's still that's a rule for my life. Oh, yeah, that's a good rule. Sometimes when my daughter does it just barely, or even not at all, but I think she might have, I'll say, Dayoida. <laughs> Get away from me! That's how she says dad, but uh, when she says mom, she says ma'am. <laughs> it's not mom, it's like mem. M- mem. <laughs> mem. It's like a mix between mem and mim. Ma'am! <laughs> Where do we put our wet clothes? Ma'am! And my boys have picked up on this, and so they'll say it when they want to bother her, and then of course she takes the bait and lets it bother her. What did you do? Jeez, Peter. Did you just waste 12 Zonai? No. Oh. Didn't. Oh. <gasps> it's not gonna work. Oh, yeah? Didn't what was that about it not working? It didn't work at all. It worked perfectly. You're I not wanted to make it. <laughs> <laughs> We're just stamina. It's almost gone. You're down to like 1 and 25% of a second ring. You got lucky. This is going faster. We're we're go, almost go, go. there. As long as you discount the time that it took to do this once already and fail. <laughs> well, shh. <coughs> Be quiet about that. You know, that, if that you only my point count wrong. the parts that worked, then it all worked perfectly. And it only took two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it's just an uh, unedited speedrun cheat. <laughs> Remember for a while when, like, someone would play every yep, note on the guitar one now. set at a time, and then the editing would make them, like, play Dreamweaver? Is that a song? I think it's a Burt Reynolds song. <laughs> Dreamweaver. That's a song. It's ancient. You know who's cool? Look Abba. at that. Oh, Look how quickly you got! I should have kept my guard up. Oh man, he took my bow. I can't possibly go down there and fetch it from him. I can fly though. Now, did we look here? We did before. But the, but so he wasn't there wasn't... until you talked to the dirt nerd yep. bird. <laughs> you want to help me? Not yet. I can wait. <laughs> oh Woo! yeah! Now we can get Tulin's wind power. Woo! Guy's not gonna know what hit him. Son, I'm very disappointed that you lost my bow. Here, have my bow that means so much more to me. He never knows that you lost. He lost the bow. He's like, help me lie to my dad. Oh, Link tells him. <laughs> he lost it. <laughs> he lost that bow. He lost that bow, sir. Sir, your son is a screw up. Should never have trusted him with anything important. Oh no! Now there's some really weak enemies. Whatever will we do? <laughs> we shall kill them. We will kill them all to death. Yeah, this wasn't exciting for me. I was like, these enemies are not a challenge. But then Tulin starts shooting, and I'm like, okay, this is pretty cool. I'm glad he can do that. I took my time enough that, yeah, Tulin actually, yeah. Nice that was cool. Tulin. It was like hit and then smack. <coughs> Arrow and followed deftly by a sword strike across the front of his face, leaving a bloody gash. What? Oh, I'm so excited to hear that noise. <laughs> was that the wind or some kind of chime? It was a wind chime, stupid. <laughs> You're in big trouble now, mister. You lost the bow. Okay, I want to try something. I'm going to set a teleport pad here, but before we started the episode, I activated the shrine that was like halfway up. Right. I'm going to see if teleporting there, if Tulin will meet us there. Yeah, that's interesting, because like once you start the thing, he's like, I'll wait here. Yeah. But we're not. But yeah, we have a shrine that's that like yet? halfway there. Yeah. But maybe we are. <clears throat> So yeah, is it going to treat it like we're in the dungeon or not? That's a good question. 
Tulin, we're counting on you. This is why you stick around to the end of these, uh... Choose the Kingdom videos. Wait, do I have to... Did we set it somewhere? Uh, is it in the sky? Uh, do we have it? Yeah, I thought so. Isn't that the thing that I just saw? Yeah. Uh, but it's unusable in its current state. It's missing some important data. Oh. No. So we haven't done that yet. Well, you know what? Fooey. I don't want to have to get back here again if I screw it up, though. Well, I can fly down to here. Honestly. Oh. So I'm going to I'm gonna go here and see if Tulin warps, and if he's not here, I'll just fly down to this spot. That'd be cool if he did, though, because shortcut. Big shortcut. Well, kind of. I was already there, but. Yeah, yeah you have to. You have to go there to get the shortcut, but what the game wants you to do is for Tulin to drag you up to that point at this point. Oh, he yoinks it back. Nope, he said all, yeah. Oh, he meets way, you Link. back down there. Yeah, for real. I didn't see Zelda go that way. Yeah, you did. We're going to go right back past this place. That's two lies, Tulin. First, you didn't well, lose your Well, now we bow. know. And second, you didn't see Princess Zelda go this way. What a jerk. That cute little bird that just wants to help so much and looks up to Link. Total jerk. Uh, Where is he? Left. Right there. See him? No, I'm looking at the map. He's got to yeah, be on that platform, he's though, right? he's right here. Like, on me. But no, he's not there. Uh-oh. Soft lock. Is he... Okay, hang on. Is he maybe up high in like a weird oh, in-between place? Just like the start of yeah. the up here? Yeah. That's weird. That he would yeah, disappear not... but not go back to where you last saw him. <clears throat> yeah. We're experimenting. We're finding things out. It's weird, but we're learning. Experiment. Tulin is this way. Is my third favorite mint. What's your third favorite mint? Environment. Oh, there's there he is. Look oh, that's that. my least favorite mint. Oh, we have to talk to him before we are supposed to know what a boat is. That's a boat. <laughs> now we know what a boat is. Well, we did skip a good chunk of trying to get up to this point. That's, so that's true. That's good. He warped straight to here from the. the <gasps> She's up there. Oh. Yeah, it's because this whole like cut scene. They're like, we got to make sure he get to see this. To me. Come to me. For the oh. most part, I think Nintendo like anticipated little um, sequence breaks like that and handled them not too terribly cheaply, but like decently. Like it makes sense that they want us to see this. Yeah, but on your second playthrough, you should really be able to skip some of this. Well, stuff. that's the big complaint. But as far as Nintendo knows, though, this isn't our second playthrough. Right? This is just the basement account on Peter's Switch. Okay, that's fair. It's the first time this account has played through this game. But yeah, it would be nice if just up front you could select a thing that says, I've played this before. Please give me the, I've played it before experience. And then yeah. it's like, are you sure? Because if you haven't played this before and you select this mode, it means that you will miss out on some important story elements that will provide you with crucial information to play the game. <laughs> and then you say, yes. Yes, I'm sure. Are you sure you're sure? <laughs> <laughs> mm, I changed my mind now. Actually, no. I fell in love with the tooling ability, though, of getting a, like a horizontal blast while you're gliding. Because that's how I got everywhere in my first, like, personal playthrough of Tears of the Kingdom. Is I, whoop, whoop, whoop. Here we go. I just, I towered up and I glided. 
So getting the um, suit was important, like the glide suit, but I didn't know about it until really late. But the other thing that was really important was tooling and, like, stamina. And I didn't build many machines. I just used those mechanics to get around. Oh, yeah, I built a lot of machines. Look at these icicles. In fact, my f my first playthrough, I used... Gobs of machines. I used gobs of uh, springs, just kind of like what we're doing now. Thank you. Yeah, I remember this well, too, because I wanted those horns to, like, attach to weapons. And I'd almost kill him, and then Tulin would shoot him off, and he'd fall into the drink. Be gone. Stick it, Tulin. Why doesn't the game just set him down? <laughs> Stinking game. Such a handy shortcut, though, to use the springs. Yeah, it works way too good in the water. Temple. Yeah. You use one set like that, and you go all the way to the top. Yeah. And they give you the idea, too, with those springy ships under the ice. It's like, come on. You know we're going to use our own springs if we got them. Why wouldn't right. we? He's stupid. Oh, he came in this time. You gonna jump on Ted? Because he hasn't taken an allergy pill yet? I did take one. Oh. I was just sneezy for some reason. Yeah, I don't well, you only had a couple. <laughs> easy come, easy go. Man, that's a long ways up. What's the deal with the conveyance in this game? Mediocre at best. I kind of liked it closer. though. I kind of liked looking around and not knowing where to go. And then knowing where to go. Because I looked around. <laughs> it's rewarding. At a very elementary level. Which is, you know, kind of what I want. Leave it to me. Oh, we can go all the way over there. Or. Or. Or we could skip it. We don't set it in the snow. There you go. Uh, 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 uh. Can you ascend up through the trampoline? I think you can. Nope. Oh. What do you need to is the question. Uh-oh. You're stuck, Ted. What are you going to do now? Uh, don't fall off. I just have to say that so that if you do, I can act all perturbed. <laughs> and exasperated. Oh, that's the word I was looking for. I forgot what the word you used were. Maybe you could do it if you weren't on the seams. Oh, there it is. Boom. Right through the ice like a champ. I wonder if that hurts. Look at that. We definitely sped through that a little faster than you're supposed to. I'm grateful for it. We gotta get rolling in this game, you know? Yeah. Gotta get cooking. I will say, though, we are at the end of this episode, and we only got about halfway. Or maybe, yeah, about halfway. Yeah, we're gonna get to the actual, like, fighting and puzzle part. Next time we tackle some of this. But we got done with a lot of the boring set up. Well, not boring, but just, you know, all the pre-temple stuff. The preamble. Right. Uh, if you want to watch a video with less preamble and more... Amble? 
<laughs> then you should click on the one that's on the screen right now because, boy, that is an Amblin video. Yeah. In, in the, the basement. basement. 